All right, Annie, uh, more than 50 million people have been vaccinated here in the U.S., but there is a surprising new side effect of the COVID vaccine that is mirroring breast cancer symptoms. In some cases, doctors, doctors are recommending to space out the time between the vaccine and your next mammogram. Marcella Robertson has the story. Fevers, chills, and body aches are the side effects of the COVID vaccine we hear the most about. But the vaccine can also cause swollen lymph nodes. Dr. Jennifer Permesia with Virginia Hospital Center says those swollen lymph nodes can often be felt in the armpit area. It's perfectly expected to see swollen lymph nodes after a vaccine. Generally, we see swollen lymph nodes on the same side as the vaccine. They can pop up days after the shot and can last up to four weeks. But early on, Dr. Permesia says it should not be a cause for concern. It simply means the vaccine is working. Here's when you should follow up. If the lymph nodes persist beyond that, if they become hard, if they become rubbery, uh, that's not expected. Approximately 11% of people will experience swollen lymph nodes after the first dose of vaccination, and that number rises to 16% after the second dose of vaccination. Now the Society for Breast Imaging recommends people should schedule mammograms either before their shot or wait anywhere from four to six weeks after to avoid any confusion. But doctors stress this is on a case-by-case -case basis. If you're a woman who's behind on your mammogram, you delay it because of COVID, I would not delay that. Additionally, if you're a patient who's scheduled to get a CT scan or a PET CT, those are really important diagnostic tests for uh, cancer evaluation and to delay that kind of diagnosis for several months could be quite dangerous and it could lead to a different stage of cancer diagnosis and a different treatment regimen. And doctors want to be clear, the COVID-19 vaccine absolutely does not increase your chance of breast cancer or cause cancer. The swollen lymph nodes are just a normal response. That means the vaccine is working and they will eventually go away. Tony? Marcella, uh, if I can, I want to ask you a quick question. Mm -hmm. Does the doctor say if this is more common in one vaccine over the other? Yeah, I, I asked her that question and she says both of these vaccines are really uh, just, they're called reactogenic vaccines. So they really provoke a very strong immune response. Uh, so you're not going to see it one over the other, Pfizer versus Moderna. But again, if you see any of these symptoms, whether it's fever, chills, swollen lymph nodes, it just means the vaccine is working. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you very much. Allison, over to you.